diversity in the living world. It is estimated that more than 5 million species are present on Earth. Of these, about 1.7 million species are known and described. Every year, several new species are described and added to the list. Since study of all organisms is nearly impossible, they are classified into groups for the convenient study. Terminology used in classification A. Nomenclature B. Classification C. Taxonomy D. Systematics A. Nomenclature Often, the organisms around us are known by local names which differ from place to place and language to language. Hence, there is a need to standardize naming them. Scientists have formulated certain procedures to assign scientific name to each organism. International Code for Botanical Nomenclature, ICBN, and International Code for Zoological Nomenclature, ICZN, were evolved to assign scientific names for plants and animals, respectively. A scientific name has two components, generic name and the specific epithet. This system of naming is called binomial nomenclature. It was given by Carlos Linnaeus and is used by biologists all over the world. Examples Mangifera indica, mango. Homo sapiens, man. Here, Mangifera and Homo are generic names. Indica and sapiens are specific epithets. Rules of nomenclature 1. Each biological name has two words. The first word represents genus and the second represents the specific epithet. 2. The words of the name should be separately underlined when handwritten and should be in italics when printed. 3. The generic name should start with a capital letter and specific epithet should start with a small letter. 4. The name should be either Latin or Latinized. 5. Name of the author appears at the end of the scientific name in an abbreviated form. Example, Homo sapiens, Lin. It indicates that this species is first described by Linnaeus. B. Classification. It is the arrangement of organisms in specific groups or categories based on certain characters. These categories are called taxa, singular taxon. C. Taxonomy. It is the study of identification, nomenclature and classification of organisms based on external and internal structure with cell structure, development process, and ecological information. D. Systematics. It is the study of organisms with reference to identification, nomenclature, classification and evolutionary relationship.